Hello guys on YouTube, your boy, I am Andrew Laycock, 007. So far, we have got 337. So, thank you, thank you so much for all that stuff. And uh, today, we are going to react to um, Lance Stewart down there. I proposed, so let's get to it. Today is Sunday, May 10th, 2020, and five months ago, me and my girlfriend Julia officially started dating. When I first met Julia, I felt as if I already knew her, and it was the weirdest thing ever because we were instantly so comfortable around each other, and that's the first time I've ever experienced that in my life with somebody. Of course, we were nervous around each other because we both had interest in each other, but it was this weird feeling that I just simply never felt. I just had this instant connection with her, and I just knew something was special about this girl. There's a reason she came into my life. Now, of course, before we started actually dating, we were talking for a couple months, getting to know each other, and I didn't want to rush into another relationship unless I knew that it felt right, because simply, I don't want to waste my time. I said it to myself, I said it to my fans, the next person I decide to date is going to be the person that I marry. And I was being 100% truthful. Hey right, guys, if you're going to watch this tonight, make sure you hit that love and bell on and that subscribe button. Mm. Let's see if we get to 300. And thirty, no, one hundred and forty subscribers. I meant to say. Hold on, guys. So, guys, I had to turn off my lamp off. So, guys, wake up, say, well, that video I was in there. It's one of those Lance Stewart videos. It's called I Proposed. So I was thinking, um, I should, well, I should have done that video. Um, it would be cool if I did that video in the future with me and my girlfriend, um, as McGee. So, babe, I love you. Maybe in the future, when we get older, I would love to, to propose when we get older. First, so let's back this. Let's get let's get to this video. When I said that, when I first laid my eyes on Julie, I was like, "Whoa, this girl is gorgeous." I instantly had an attraction to her physical appearance, of course. But when we started talking, I realized how smart she was and how much we connected on an intellectual level, and that's what really sparked my interest in her. Not only is Julia smart and beautiful, but she's also very funny. She is like myself, super creative, and honestly, every time I'm around. Hey guys, yeah, um, I was thinking. Well, I know, I know me and my girlfriend are too young. I know, I know me and my girlfriend are too young to get married, but um, to, to be engaged, I meant um, I know we are too young, but for my future, and just want to stay well. And just be a, just stay as a um boy and the girlfriend first, and then we will think about um we were going to do. So yeah, guys, when I when I must when I met them um, um as a McGee, I was like, um well, we go to some clubs, like in the houses. Cross sweets and she is love she's lovely. She's she's beautiful and I will always be her. I will always be her um boyfriend, I will always be here for her. So guys I know I know it's like mm, we just met so I don't know what how many years but that's what this video. I can understand why people may think that, but I 
I've spent almost every single day with this girl since I've met her. Even though I've been with Juliet for what may seem like a very short period of time, to me it's felt like an eternity, and I truly do want to spend the rest of my life with her. Now, I know everyone's excited to see what's about to happen. Honestly, I am beyond nervous. I know in my heart she's going to say yes. But of course, it's such a nerve-wracking thing to do. I'm now going to show you footage back from February, only two months after we started dating, when I purchased the ring. Okay, so it is Thursday, February 20th, 2020. I just purchased the engagement ring. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I don't know, she's texting me right now. Are you okay? I, I thought we were coming. This is all so soon. Yeah, I thought we were just coming. Just the walk. I just don't know when I'm. Hey guys, um, he's one of my favorite YouTubers, Lance Stewart. He's one of those good YouTubers. He's got good, um, he's got good. Career, they can do videos like pranks, um, spending time with his family, all that good stuff. So yeah. As you can see, my parents said that I still have to ask her parents. Which, yes, I, I bought the ring without even asking the parents' approval first. Definitely not the smartest idea, but I knew in my heart that they would accept me. This ring is absolutely beautiful. Honestly, I didn't expect to get a ring that day. I was just going to look, but I fell in love with the piece. So, you're probably curious, when did I ask her parents? And I just remember every single day wanting to ask, but never actually doing it. And the main reason behind doing that is because we're currently in quarantine because of the coronavirus. And her parents were actually in Florida at the time. And of course, I live in New Jersey, so does her family, but they have a place out in Florida as well. And I know that they weren't coming back anytime soon, and I planned on doing this on her birthday, so I needed to ask. So I ended up figuring out a way to get Julia's parents' phone number from her without it seeming, like, too suspicious. I got on a FaceTime call with both of her parents, and I asked for their blessing to let me marry their daughter. Jokingly enough, her father actually said no to me at first, but he said it in a joking way. And then he, of course, said yes. Once he said that, I was so relieved. They actually both seemed very happy for me to ask that question to them. I actually have the date written down on my phone of when I asked. So as I said, I got the ring February 20th. And I didn't ask her parents until a whole month later on March 27th. Enough of the backstory. Let's tell you guys exactly how this is going to go down. As you guys know, I am a prankster. And one of the things that me and Julia have constantly joked about is that the ring that I'm going to get her when I propose to her is a blue ring pop. I don't know why or even how this became a thing, but it is. So, what I have planned is a Louis Vuitton box. And then when she opens up the box itself, she's going to notice that there's a ring box in there. And then when she goes to open up the ring box, it is simply going to be a blue blue ring pop. Obviously it's a joke. I am then going to proceed to give her her actual birthday gift, which you guys will see. And then after that, I am going to propose. Wish me luck. Here we go. Baby, ready? Well, guys, see, um, when I, look, I'm a fan of it. I'm a big fan of him. I'm just like, all those famous YouTubers doing those repost videos, like, you know, if you got a girlfriend or you got a lovely girl in your life, like, you know, like, giving her things like chocolates, flowers, um, like, like, if you guys can think what girls like, like, you know, yeah, like, perfume or lovely stuff. So, I'm kinda, and guys, I know I got a good life. I know I got a lovely family. I know I got a lovely girlfriend. I just want to say I love him so much. But my, girl, my girlfriend, yeah, well, she's a bit, she's a male the world. She mean a world to me. She's amazing. I will always love her. She's my life. So let's, let's go with this video.
Hey guys, so those things um, she gave to Julia, she, you know, she looks very really happy in that video because of that story giving like, um, he, he, as he said in the start, he said he's a, a, a prankster, so she gave her um, a fake ring, it's one of those fake rings, so and now he's giving her f lovely flowers, so I might do that to my girlfriend. So yeah. So let's go to this video. Hey guys, that that was that um that was at that moment that those people propose um someone like your your girlfriend or you, if you got a girlfriend um if someone's got a girlfriend like you know you uh, enjoy your love life being more romantic being a a gentleman a a gentleman. Um, gave him lovely things like oh like when it gets to next ne next year when it gets to um happy Valentine's Day I might do seven I might do seven for that upload for next year so if you want if you guys want to see that let me know in the comment section. Baby for that. <laughs> my mom. My mom has a little surprise. Like him. Um, if you look in those lovely pictures of Lana Stewart and Joya, those guys are lovely. Couple. Like, I know a lot of. Well, he actually did this about three months ago. 
Um, about 3.9 million people watched it. A lot of people. So, if you guys are going to watch this, watch this please hit that like button. This is going to get to 25 likes for this. That would be lovely. So, let's give this video. Wait guys, um, for my opinion, um, I have to say that, um, I have to say this, um, they look a, a lovely couple. I know I say, I know I'm not, I'm not just saying that, but they look lovely couple. Lance, you are, you are lovely. You're cool. I love you, I hope you enjoy your, uh, go well for your, for your listenership. And I hope you get sale in, in the future. So yeah. Hey guys, um, that was Lance Stewart. Um, I proposed video. So, if you guys could to watch this, just make sure you hit that post notification bell on and that subscribe button. And if you guys enjoyed that video, just make sure you hit that like button. So guys, I love you guys so much. You're being amazing. If my if my family or my girlfriend. Whatever in UK, if you're going to watch this, enjoy your life, have a, a lovely night, and yeah, stay, stay awesome.